In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the Just Enough Items mod for Minecraft. Now, the first thing you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description down below and to the pinned comment, and it is going to bring you to a page that looks like this, where it will provide you with all of the necessary files and tools that you will need in order to do this. So step number one is to download a mod loader that is compatible with the Just Enough Items mod. Now, one really great mod loader out there is Neoforge. So that's what we're going to be working with in this video. So underneath step number one, you're going to see this link over here to Neoforge. It will say neoforge.net so all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on it just like so then it is going to bring you to a page that looks like this now where it says minecraft version you want to select the version of minecraft you want to play the just enough items mod in and then you guys can select on the neoforge version for this video let's just go ahead and go with the most recent one and all you want to do is you want to press on click here to download installer now while that's downloading let me tell you guys about simple game hosting Simple Game Hosting offers affordable and high quality Minecraft servers where you're easily able to make a Minecraft server with you and all of your friends. The best part about having your own server is that you have full control over everything and Simple Game Hosting makes it incredibly easy to make this server a crossplay server, Java only, Bedrock only, you guys could add dozens of plugins and mods and even mod packs all with the click of a single button. On top of that, there's dozens of video guides and 24-7 live customer support to help you out at any point during the day. So guys, if this sounds interesting, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comments. Anyways guys, that is enough yapping out of me. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to go ahead and actually drag and drop the Neoforge installer to our desktop just like so. And I personally recommend that you guys do the same thing just for clarity purposes and it's going to make the process significantly easier. All right, afterwards, you want to head back over to the website over here. And the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be downloading the Just Enough Items mod over here. So you just want to go ahead and press on the link underneath step number two. Then it is going to redirect you to a page that looks like this. It is going to say Just Enough Items. And then over here, you want to go ahead and download it for Neoforge over here. And of course, the Minecraft version that you're working with. So throughout this entire video, you want to work with the same Minecraft version. So you never want to mix and match versions or anything like that. So throughout this entire video, we are working with Minecraft 1.21.8. So I'm going to go ahead and download the Just Enough Items mod for Minecraft 1.21.8 for Neoforge. So let's just go ahead and press on this download button right over here. And again, we're just going to go ahead and drag and drop the Just Enough Items uh, file to our desktop just like so. We're then going to be heading over back to the website. Now, the next thing we need to do is we need to install Java 21. Now, in order to run mods, in order to run shaders, and basically anything involving Minecraft, you will need to have Java installed on your device. So underneath step number three, you're going to find this link over here that says oracle.com. And it is going to redirect you to a page that looks like this, where you can go ahead and select on JDK21, then select on your operating system, and then you can go ahead and install Java for your operating system. So me personally, I'm on a Windows, so I would go ahead and select on Windows. Then I would install the x64 installer just like so. And then once you went ahead and install it, it is going to walk you through the entire setup wizard. And it really shouldn't take too long to actually install Java. It is going to walk you through the entire process, and it really doesn't take up that much time. All right, so once you're done with that, the next thing you want to do is you want to minimize out of your web browser for a little bit. And now we're going to be focusing on our desktop. So at this point, you should have three things. You should have Java installed. You should have Neoforge and the Just Enough Items file right over here. What you want to do from here is you want to hover over to Neoforge, then you want to right click on it, then select on Open With. Now, if you did install Java on your device, you should see this option that says Java TM Platform SE Binary, which is why I strongly emphasize downloading Java beforehand. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and select on Java right over here. And then eventually it is going to bring you to a page that looks like this. So make sure you select on install client, then go ahead and press on proceed just like so. And now all you got to do is you got to go ahead and just wait for it to download. Again, it really shouldn't take too long. Thankfully, Neoforge isn't too heavy or anything like that. So it really shouldn't take you that long. All right. Afterwards, you're going to get a screen that looks like this. So go ahead and just press on OK, just like so. And the next thing you want to do is you want to open up the Minecraft launcher like you normally would. All right, guys. So once you're in the Minecraft launcher, please make sure that Java Edition is selected. Then all you want to do is you want to go to the top menu, then press over here where it says installations. Where it says versions, please make sure that the box that says modded is turned on because this is technically considered a modded version of Minecraft. Afterwards, all you want to do is you want to go ahead and look for the option that says Neoforge. So yep, here it is. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and go to the folder icon, then press on open installations folder. You're then going to get a folder that looks like this, but do not be overwhelmed. All you want to do is you want to scroll down until you find a folder called mods in all lowercase. And for whatever reason, you can't able to find a folder that is called mods in all lowercase. You can go ahead and make the folder yourself. 
by right clicking then pressing on new and then folder and then calling it mods in all lowercase anyways guys all you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up the mods folder all right so the mods folder should be empty and what you want to do from here is you want to minimize out of the minecraft launcher for a little bit and now you want to drag and drop the just enough items mod inside of the mods folder just like so so literally just drag and drop it and once you're done with that you can close out of the mods folder return back to the minecraft launcher go over here towards his play in the version selector make sure that neoforge is selected then go ahead and press on play just like so and what you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and wait until minecraft loads in and yep there you go it is now loading in so it did take relatively quick for me however if it's your first time ever using neoforge or your first time ever using mod this process may take a little bit longer all right guys so here we are in minecraft and towards the bottom left you'll now notice that it will say neoforge and that mods are actually activated so now all you want to do is you want to go ahead and load into any minecraft world or you guys can go ahead and load into a pre-existing world but check this out here we are guys and if we go ahead and open our inventory yep you will notice that we will actually get the just enough items menu right over here which is incredibly useful if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe as we are trying to reach 400,000 subscribers. Please like, comment, subscribe. See you later, french fries.